What the fuck? Oh, my bad. Anyway, I just wanted to do something different and show off. Uh, not show off, cause I know people with Illa Collection. Just what I've been into lately, other than music and sneakers and shit. I've been buying comics. So now, as you see, the new 52. These are the new thing I guess they're doing with comics. If you didn't know, as far as um. DC or whatever or Marvel whatever you want to call it this issue actually was um last month sometime or no it was this month where they did a free um comic day you dig so if you see right there say free comic book day and I guess this is one of the new 52 new 52 basically mean new origins of uh characters and shit like that for comic books you dig so this is the um new 52 of Batman Beyond if y'all know what that is all about. I'm not going to open them up and everything like that. So that's why you see the uh, issue zero. But I picked these up from a place uh, in a mall out here in um, this city. I'm not going to say where. But um, it's like a, a place where... How can I pit it? You can go there and um, buy comics and sports memorabilia and shit like that. You know, um, they do... You can buy, sell, and trade shit basically there. That's that, that type of place, you know what I'm saying? So, I just be going there randomly. I spend about five bucks on comics just randomly. People that um I like or whatever. It's not like an actual comic book store where the new shit comes out. Like, you know, Secret Wars and new Batman and new Wolverine and things of that nature. I don't really have a comic book uh, store in the area. I don't even know if they still exist. But, yeah, so this is just one of the ones I got. This is a uh, Justice League, as you see, um, New 52. And I got DC and Marvel, so yeah. Comic book's still kind of cheap, you know. This is the Justice League of America issue. All of, you know, August of 2013. So it's kind of old, you know. They did uh, New 52 a couple years ago. So it's comic book like two years old. I doubt they're worth anything, so don't ask me if they're worth anything. Just something I'm into lately, you know. This is January of 08. Years ago. And I know you're like, well, why are you starting to get comic books now? I was always into them as a kid, you know what I mean? But I never really collected any of them. My cousin used to collect a lot of shit, you know. I don't know if he even sold his collection. Because I know his collection was damn near worth... When I was a kid... Uh, cause he had comics from, you know, 60s and 70s and shit like that. I think he said back then in the early 90s, his comic book collection was worth like 10 grand. So I'm quite sure that, you know, it's worth a lot more. And yeah, so I just been, you know, lately here and there. You see like the little sticker marks because like I said, they get them and they sell them for whatever they want to sell them for. So most of these is like a buck, you know, the most two, three, you know what I mean? But I thought it looked as stupid having it on the packet, so I just took them off. And you see Batman right here. I've read at least five of these. I haven't read them all. This one was kind of ill. Most of them I picked up based off the um, the cover alone. As you see, this is a series. This is seven of seven, so it's like six more of this. And that's what I like about comic books because they have a story, and it's like maybe in each story, probably like six to seven comics sometimes. Secret Wars is what I'm, I'm trying to look for and find. You dig? Got Nightwing right here. Oh, shit. It's pretty ill. Like I said, they vary in prices. So, it's just something to do, you know. This one is kind of special to me because you see the year it dropped, 89. I was like five years old when this shit came out. Yes, I'm not a young man. <laughs> I mean, I'm a young man, but, you know, I'm not no fucking teenager, no shit like that, but... It is what it is. Captain Adam. Pretty dope. And you see right here, you got the Justice Society of America. I like the graphics and everything like that. And I know you're like, damn, man, you should have opened one of them at least so we could look at them and see. I mean, you got Google, you know, Comic Story and uh, Variant Comics, Comics Explained. You know, they do a good job of updating people on the latest and you know, news on comics, movies, and shit like that. So go check them out, man. They they are dope. Like, I'm following them. You look at my history, you'll see uh, a 
couple of videos. And this will begin to the Marvel section. Well, actually, the Marvel section started with this one. But, you know, Iron Man. I got this today. Pretty ill. I like Iron Man. Avengers. Earth's Mightiest Heroes. I watched this cartoon when it was out. Justice League cartoon when it was out. This is the upcoming movie. Ant-Man. You dig? I wonder if y'all looking at this. Who can name every character on here? If a person can name every character on here. Not by using Google or no shit like that. Just watching the video right now. Pause it right now. And just try to tell me each one of these characters who you think they are. You know what I mean? It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It's 12 of them. So whoever is correct with all 12, I got something in store for y'all. And I know if y'all lied and went to Google and tried to check it out. So that's for all the little nerds out there. This series I actually want to try to finish because it's like, you know, Hawkeye look dope. Y'all don't know who that guy is. He looking at though, huh? <laughs> he ill. This is an older one I had, you know, Wolverine, part one. Good story. It's one of the first ones. I think if y'all remember my channel earlier, like last year, y'all remember these two? Iron Man and the Wolverine joint. Pretty sick. Both of them are good. I grabbed this one today. The New Avengers. Pretty badass. Look at Wolverine, though. And how y'all feel about the cat from um, Leverage? You know, the guy that used to... Uh, Beat up people, I guess, the muscle. He's supposed to be the new Wolverine. How do y'all feel about that? This one is ill because the direct edition. So I was like, oh, shit, he going to be the new Wolverine. That's pretty dope. I think I posted it on uh, Instagram or my Facebook. But if I did, not I'll go put it on IG. And it's the late, latest two I bought. The new Avengers. Pretty dope. And then a the Hulk. Of course, I've seen this in... Based off of the cover alone, man, I had to grab it. This shit is dope. So a lot of these stories, you know, when I can take the time and take the money and go find out and um, finish them, I definitely want to see what they're all about. Hold on. I was just curious to see how the pictures in this one look. See how the detail is, man? That shit look hella sick, though. Speed Racer. Look at that. The detail is just fucking phenomenal, man. Just flip through it. I don't want to get flagged or no shit like that. That's kind of dope, too. DVD. I need to find that Legend of Wolverine. But yeah, man, just want to do something different for y'all. So hopefully y'all enjoy comics and shit like that. I was going to talk about some other shit that I've seen, but I'll probably save it for a different video. But y'all let me know what y'all think about comic books and are you into them, are you not? And it's nothing wrong being a nerd, man. Just be a fresh, fly, cool nerd and be yourself. Other than that, who give a fuck what people say? Yeah, I'm grown and still read comics, buy sneakers and love music. But at the same time, I take care of my family and myself. Y'all been all that, man. One.